Hello there, this is Manalux and I'm Manalux and Dead Tarot. It is Tuesday, November 9th, 2021. Welcome to my channel. If you're new here, welcome, welcome, glad to have you. If you are a long-term subscriber, I thank you for your continued support. If you have not already done so, could you please like, share, and subscribe? Thank you. How are you doing today, everybody? I hope you're doing well. I hope you're taking care of yourself and the people around you and vice versa. I hope you know you're beautiful, you're gorgeous, and you have that beautiful star shining bright inside of you. This is a general reading. It will not resonate with everyone out there. Take what does and leave the rest. And there is no gender in tarot. Watching Terminator 2 on Netflix. Cut in the deck for the collective. Spirit. The Fool. What a nice card to start with. The Fool. This is Aries energy. The Fool. This is uh, the beginning of a new journey. Taking a leap of faith. This is the first card in the Major Arcana. She is getting ready to step off the cliff, uh, but she's she's on her broom, so she doesn't have to worry. I like the bird in the sky. A new journey, a leap of faith. What's crossing this? Ooh, nine of pentacles. Single because I want to be single. Pentacles are earth energy. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Pentacles are coins. Her dress is gold, well, because gold is gold, and there's green on it because pentacles are earth energy. She's sitting there reading a book. she got a glass of wine. She is a business person, ground and balance stable, makes her own money, takes care of her money, single because she wants to be single. Consciously known, the high priestess, divine feminine, independent, Sitting in her throne, sitting in her power. She is empathic. She's intuitive. She knows how to figure people out. As you can see, she has tarot cards, a crystal ball, black cat, runes, books. Kind of a witchy type vibe here. The high priestess. Unconscious. Page of wands. Wands are fire energy. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. I like in, there's an iguana. Page of Wands, he's got a pack sack. Uh, this is a passionate message. Wands are all about passion. Pages are messengers. This is a passionate message. Recent past. Four of Wands, 11-11. This is my party card. See, it's like they are casting spells, streamers into the air. This is talking about... Um, they're having a rehearsal for a wedding, rehearsal for a hand fasting. It looks like a castle here. They're having a celebration. 11-11. Oh. Increase in the level of commitment in a relationship. Near future. Four of Pentacles. Pentacles are Earth Energy, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. As you can see, he's sitting on his uh, chest of money. Uh, this could mean that you are holding on to someone with your heart chakra. Also, whenever I see the Four of Pentacles, um, take care of your money, especially if you are a successful business person. Just watch your money. Save more than you spend. Save more than you spend. Always good advice. Where do you find yourself? Four of Cups. Four of Cups. Did someone break your heart here? Cups are water energy. Can't spicy Scorpio. He is sad, apathetic, not interested. He's looking at the three empty cups. But here, Source Spirit Universe is trying to give you that cup of self-love because you need to love yourself before you can love other someone else. Four of Cups. External influences, the magician, the great manifester, Let's cast spells with his or her hands. Yeah, his or her. I always think of the magician as male, but no gender. Um, looks like heart or his magic from within is shining out. You can manifest cups for love, pentacles for money, wands for passion. 
Swords for Honest Clear Communication. Notice my new sword. Oh, up there. What are you manifesting? Because it's coming to you. The great manifester. I like the magician. Hopes and or fears. Page of Pentacles. We got another message here. Messen messenger. Pentacles are Earth Energy. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. He's got a map. Um, looks like he's choosing a direction. Interesting. This is a money message. Money message coming in for you. And it looks like... In this card, I would think that um, you could be choosing a path. Maybe a new way to make money. I'm not sure. It's interesting. Overall outcome? Ten cups. Look at that. Ultimate abundance and love. Cups are water energy. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Happy couple. Child. Baby. Cats. Ten cups. Ultimate abundance and love. Um, I like the water here. Sometimes a house, you know, whatever, white picket, plant, pen, white picket fence, what have you, ultimate abundance in love. I like it. Bottom of the deck, three of cups, happiness, friendship, reunion. These three people are having drinks. They may, probably haven't seen each other for a bit. Reunion, friendship. The tower. The tower. This is a cataclysmic change that you cannot prepare for. The cow the tower. Tower has to fall. You can't stop it. It's gonna happen. But the tower falls because it was not built on a firm foundation. After after the tower falls, you can rebuild, but on a firm foundation this time. Three of Pentacles, working on something with someone else. Building a page of swords. Oh, somebody's watching you. Swords are air energy. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Pages are messengers. This is my stalker card. See, he's got books here. Somebody could be watching you. Three of Swords. A broken heart, too. Swords are air energy. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. This is these three cups that are spilled right here. King of Wands. King of Passion. Wands are fire energy. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. There is a, a dragon um, on the outside of his map says some I can't read it to you the king of passion the king of wands good-looking charismatic fun to be with sexy exciting let us see we had a new journey successful business person divine feminine knows how to figure people out passionate message 11 11 Taking care of your money, manifesting, money message, ultimate abundance in love, friendship, king of passion. I gotta say that the, I think this is, uh, we had the four of cups, the tower. Cataclysmic change. We had a stalker card and a broken heart. Did you did you break someone's heart or did someone break your heart? I don't know. With the ten of cups there in your overall outcome, this must be past energy. Let's see what the oracle cards have to say. Co-create. Working together with someone. After the tower falls, you work on something with someone else. This would be Three of Pentacles, working on a solid foundation. I like that. Fork in the road. Fork in the road. Time to choose a path. 
interesting how this page of pentacles with the map and with the this way or that way sign fork in the road choosing a path interesting that came out again because i don't usually see choosing a path with this card higher power look to your higher power maybe you're your own higher power with the high priestess we all need a higher power though or what Doreen what do you have to say oh engagement we did have the four of wands You deserve love. You are lovable. Four of Cups. Source Spirit Universe trying to give you a cup. Release your ex. The time has come to clear your energy. Yeah, I would say this is past energy. Either you broke someone's heart or someone broke your heart. But release your ex. Leave it in the past where it belongs. The sun, Leo energy, the sun shines a beautiful bright light over the whole rest of your spread. The, ha the sun, happiness, joy, bliss, love it. Bottom of the deck, the emperor, or divine masculine. Divine masculine, independent, sits in his power, can be uh, stubborn. And my way or the highway, maybe that's... Why you released someone. Alrighty. Start of a new journey. I gotta say that's three of swords must be past energy. Start of a new journey. Single because you want to be single. Divine feminine, empathic. Passionate message, we had money message, ultimate abundance in love, friendship, the magician, ma the great manifester, king of passion, and increase in level of commitment, engagement, you deserve love, release your ex, co-create, fork in the road, higher power, the sun, love it, the emperor. All right, I love, I love, I love. Ten of cups in your future. And increase the level of commitment. And the magician, and the magician. All right, I went a new journey. <laughs> okay. I like this, I like this. Have a great day day or a rest to have the great great rest of your day i will speak to you tomorrow um this is amanda wilkson of amanda wilkson tarot bye for now